Hello and welcome to the channel. Welcome back if you're one of me 99 subscribers. I need one more to hit my first milestone of 100 subscribers. Didn't expect getting them that fast. Hit that subscribe button. Be me 100 subscribers. Get us over that milestone. Come on. Anyway, I'm here in Tala in Dublin and I've just been to the Lewis Lyon Derby. A derby that has separated Shamrock Rovers and St. Patrick's by nine stops on the red line. Not the biggest of derbies in the world, but that's what I want to bring to this channel. I want to bring you some different derbies, some of the, some small, some big music. That's what I'm bringing to the channel. Anyway, all I'm going to say about this derby is the fans. I'm absolutely impressed. Lord of Youngins, yes, people say the Irish leagues are full of Youngins, but they are passionate. And they've got something special happening here in Ireland. I genuinely believe that. I wish back home we had some of the passion they bring. The game, football from Shamrock, no disrespect, wasn't the best. I thought they were defensively awful. But I'm no expert on Irish football. Them Shamrock fans did not stop banging their drum, waving the flags and chanting the songs. And same goes for the St. Patrick fans. They were equally impressive apart from the one on the other side of the stadium where I was. So I didn't have a proper full opinion of them. But from what I saw, what I heard from them, equally as good in my opinion. And that's what I want to keep bringing. So I hope you like this video. And again, please just subscribe, like, comment, tell us about the video. Tell us what you don't like. And I'll keep these videos coming. Yeah, I've got a couple of things coming in the next month or so. Big things, music and football. So I'll see you all soon. Enjoy the video. Before I came over to Tala, I read online and I quote, Undoubtedly, Tala is the rough area in Dublin and is considered one of the roughest or most dangerous areas whether you are a local or a tourist. Food delivery drivers avoid the area like the plague if possible, and you should too, unless you absolutely have to visit the area. Now, I would say my experience here was nothing but peace and friendly people and no sign of any trouble or bother at all. Probably like every city, town, anywhere, it probably does have some rough areas, but that is not my experience of it. And don't let something like that put you off visiting.
post, one at the back. Love to see a lot more of that this evening. Pat's been a little bit more direct. Not taking too much time to get the ball from back to front, get it into wide areas. Oh, Brandon Kavanagh is giving it away. Here's Aaron Green. Takes it on himself. Oh, wonderful finish. Rattles it in off the post. What a campaign he's having, Aaron Green. <laughs> Take a step back, allow the opposition player to have it. Maybe just nick it off him. It's a great position now for Pats. That aerial threat that we spoke about. Really test this Rovers defence. And it's Brandon Kavanagh standing over it again. They got, <laughs> they got a doorstop, it's behind the wall. That's not neither the draft excluder, whatever they call it, there's won't be needed on this occasion. This is heading to the back post. And that's where Kavanagh goes. Great job. Oh, oh, oh. and Dara Burns on the way. Still over half an hour to go, Noonan round the back. Oh, it's there again, but it's a carbon copy. slips and Melia finishes in style well they weren't behind for long Mason Melia with a sumptuous finish first real chance he's had and he's taken it
Thank you. 